Hello and welcome to the Worldwide Standard of Mathematics, Top Pop Math Chops. Uh, today we're going to prove that every horse is the same color, or as we like to call it at the Center of Math, the Monochromatic Equestrine Theorem, or uh, something along those lines. So, Uh, so the proof for this is going to be an inductive proof. If you're unfamiliar with what an inductive proof is, or maybe if you are, uh, the basic principle is that we prove our base case uh, for n equals 1. We're dealing with natural numbers here, which is good because you can't have, or I guess you could have one and a half of a horse, or, but we're just dealing with one horse, two horse, uh, all the natural numbers of horses, and they're all of the same color, as we all know. Um, and so we prove it for one horse, and then if our assumption that n horses are the same color leads to the logical conclusion that n plus 1 horses are the same color, then obviously that means all natural numbers of horses are the same color. So let's start with one horse. So this is one horse. <laughs> Obviously, it's the same color as itself. Um, so now we're going to, going to make an assumption that a group of n horses are the same color. And so these are horses from the back view. They're just circles now. Um, so we're assuming that uh, our collection of n horses is the same color. And now we want to see what we can prove about n plus 1 horses uh, are the same color. And since we proved that any kind of group of n horses is the same color, it doesn't have to be this group. It could be this group or, uh, I guess, or this group. Um, anyways, the whole point is when we have, well, we now have n plus 1 horses, uh, we have, um, some overlap between the groups. And since both groups consist of horses that are the same color, that means n plus 1 horses are the same color. Um, so of course, pause this if you want to find the uh, logical contradiction that I've conveniently skimmed over. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go into details of why this is wrong. Uh, of course, this is wrong. If your n plus 1 group is two horses, and there's no overlap here, so erasing that overlap, we don't have any, uh, we don't have any overlap, so they could be different colors. So um, thank you for watching. If you want to uh, use this proof uh, to kind of confuse some friends of yours, then please feel free to. Uh, it's a very popular math proof. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, stick around for a link to the playlist for more uh, popular math chops and uh, also links to subscribe and check out our website. Thank you for watching and have a good day.